You have just received your Beagle I squared C SPI protocol analyzer and are ready to get started using this latest addition to your engineering arsenal. In this video, we'll go through an unboxing of this product and show you how to get started using this tool for your own I squared C or SPI applications in just a few simple steps. The Beagle I squared C SPI protocol analyzer is a real time bus monitor that allows engineers to easily capture, monitor, and debug. I squared C, SPI, or MDIO traffic. It is capable of non intrusively monitoring I squared C up to 4 MHz, SPI up to 24 MHz, and MDIO up to 2.5 MHz, and offers bit level timing down to a 20 nanosecond resolution. This tool also includes a free API supporting various programming languages and is fully Windows, Linux, and Mac OS X compatible. Now, let's open the Beagle I squared C SPI protocol analyzer from its packaging. As we open the box, we are presented with the Beagle I squared C SPI protocol analyzer, as well as documentation on its one year product warranty. Also included is a six foot USB standard A to standard B cable. As you can see here, the analysis port is located on the right side of the device where you connect your Beagle I squared C SPI analyzer to your analysis computer using this USB cable. On the other end of the analyzer is a 10 pin ribbon cable that is used to connect to your I squared C or SPI system. To get started, let's download the required software. Navigate to the website by going to www.totalphase.com and log into your user account. Having a user account is required to download the software, so if you do not already have one, be sure to create one beforehand by clicking register. Now that we are logged in, navigate to the products menu on the website menu and select view all. Filter for software firmware APIs. There, you will find the data center software, the Beagle software API, USB drivers, and other available software. Click on the data center software and download the latest version based on your operating system. Before moving on to the next steps, download and install the latest version of the Total Phase USB driver. Once the data center software is downloaded, unzip and launch the software. Next, use the included USB cable to connect your Beagle I squared C SPI protocol analyzer to the analysis computer. Click on the Analyzer tab and then connect to Analyzer. From here, you'll have access to device information like your unit's serial number and license details. Select your analyzer and click OK. Next, connect your Beagle I squared C SPI analyzer to the target system using the 10 pin header cable. In our example, we will be monitoring an I squared C system. Within the data center software, users can configure the device settings for capturing either I squared C or SPI data. For SPI, choose SPI in the capture protocol option. Choose 50 MHz for the sampling rate option and enable target power based on the parameters of the target system. Users can also configure the MSB first, rising edge, and slave select polarity based on the system's parameters as well. For I squared C, Click Analyzer and then the device settings. Choose the I squared C in the Capture Protocol option. Choose 10 MHz for the sampling rate option and enable target power and I squared C pullups based on the parameters of the target system. Click OK. Now, let's start the capture by clicking the Run Capture button. As you can see, the capture has begun and is now displaying the I squared C traffic in real time in the transaction window. There you have it. With just a few simple steps, your Beagle I squared C SPI analyzer is up and running. For more information about this tool and others we offer, please visit us online at www.totalphase.com.